Steve Gamash with another Chef Knives to Go quick look product review. And this time I'm going to try my best at pronunciation. But uh, this is the Okea Shirogami or White Paper Number no. 2 Unyagi uh, Eel Knife, 150 millimeter length. And the core steel, as mentioned, is this is a uh, single bevel style blade. So the, the main steel on this side of the blade, peeking out to the edge there, is Shirogami or White Paper Number no. 2 Reactive Carbon Steel. He treats about 60 Rockwell on that coarse steel, and the construction is a soft iron cladding on the right side of the blade as you hold it, and uh, you can see that moving out into the edge there. The uh, weight on the knife is 4.9 ounces, or 139 grams, blade length right about 150, measured basically from there back to the back, distance-wise, and then the overall length about 10.9. This knife is fairly thick, as is the style, so it's about 3.7 millimeters thick, and the blade height back here is about 30.7 millimeters. Uh, the handle is a no-frills, oval, hoe-wood uh, plastic ferrule with a bit of a step here between the wood and the plastic, but definitely a no-frills handle, nice and light. This is a single bevel style blade. So the front or right side of the blade, in this case, has the big primary bevel ground down towards the edge and this does have a little bit of a secondary bevel on the edge out of the box it's not all the way ground down to the edge known as a zero grind you can see where the core steel peeks out from that uh, cladding that softer iron cladding the back side of the blade is basically flat with a slight concave known as an uda and uh, that concave, when you set the knife on the sharpening stone flat to sharpen the back side, which is the proper technique, you simply grind flat on the stone, and the perimeter will take care of itself, uh, grinding away towards the edge of the knife. This one was not super, super flat. I tinkered with it a little bit on the stones, and you can kind of see right there, it's... I need to sharpen it a little bit more, grind a little bit more on the back side. This one wasn't super duper flat out of the box. So I've got, I would have a little more work to do on the back side to get a super clean edge on it. And so I did kind of match the existing bevel disc, and it, it gets really darn, pretty darn sharp. The um, fit and finish is good. Um, not super round on these edges, but nothing to complain about. Uh, the balance point, not such a big deal on these knives, but the balance point is right about there. And again, these... This did have a lacquer finish coming out of the box, I thought. It seemed like it does have a lacquer finish to it, so you might have to sharpen it, if nothing else, to get that lacquer off the very edge to get a good sharp knife. And uh, so there you have a, a very workhorse offering if you're doing that sort of work. This is the Okea Shirogami Number no. 2 Unagi Eel Knife, 150 millimeter.